Go the Distance does Cam's Ride, otherwise known as the Cascade Locks Trail. We started our ride at the Thunder Island Brewing Company in Cascade Locks. As a little pre-ride, we pedaled east for a few miles to Pet Play Park for a great view of the Cascades before heading back to town and starting the actual ride. The actual Cascade Locks Trailhead is located near the south end of the Bridge of the Gods. Keep in mind that the trail is not flat. There are six main hills, three on the way out and the same three on the way back in reverse. See the ride description below for specifics. The hills are really not that tough. Take it slow and you'll find it's still a pretty easy ride. On this particular ride, the trail was still subject to landslides following the Eagle Creek fire. They've done a fantastic job cleaning up. That said, you'll still have to watch for the occasional rock fall for the foreseeable future. Needless to say, there are some stunning views of the fire site, especially noteworthy is how fast the forest has recovered. While the entire ride is next to busy I-84, for the most part you'll be shielded from the freeway by a corridor of trees, although sometimes you'll be right along the road. Despite the occasional noise, the trail is well worth the ride. In addition to rockfall, portions of the trail have deteriorated due to tree roots. Some of the bumps are big enough to knock your hands from the handlebars and take you down. Be particularly careful beginning at about mile 4 of the trail on the way out and about mile 16 on the way back, just before and after you cross under I-84. The paved bike trail is about seven miles each way, but we added an additional six out and back flattish miles to Ainswood State Park along the historic Columbia River Highway. Just before Ainsworth, we had to turn around. We couldn't go any further due to construction beyond Ainsworth. My understanding is that the road now is completely open all the way to Crown Point. Check before you go, however. By the way, there is a set of stairs you'll have to negotiate on the way out and on the way back. The stairs are a bit of a pain, especially if you're riding a heavy e-bike or you have bike trailers or otherwise have a heavy load. Forewarned is forearmed, however, and the stairs are hardly insurmountable. Finally, back at the trailhead. From here, it's a short pedal through town to a delicious lunch at Thunder Island. Thanks for watching.